Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2, Long War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and we're playing the legendary Iron Man Better One version of the mod. It is month number 6 for those of you who have been missing the last missions. We just defended very successfully against an invasion in North Africa, our only liberated uh, city, uh, part of the world. And just when we thought everything was going to be all right, our recruiting efforts in Brazil have been significantly impacted because um, Advent doesn't like what we're doing and they want to kill a couple of recruits. So we do have to rescue the recruit uh, sort of uh, mission. We got to bring everyone to here and then uh, uh, evac ourselves out of uh, the situation. And as you can see, reinforcements are coming in just right from the get-go, which is exactly the type of mission that you want to play. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oops. Yeah, we're putting him here. All right, Bio moves over here. Our sniper shares some high ground up here. Full cover. No one capable of going up there? You are. Okay, perfect. So just stay here, hunker down. Thank you. Same deal for you. Good. Bob Ross moves into cover. And we got our assaults. Basically taking the flanks and certainly last but not least Mitch Mitchell. <clears throat> and everyone goes for Overwatch. Those guys theoretically should be dead. Yeah, we can't do much against Overwatch, but we most certainly can do something against a newly approaching group. And by looking at the number of advents that are over here, holy shit. Wow, they are just barely outside of vision range. So I think we got blue screen rounds on her. Moving up close using lightning reflexes. And this here should be a kill. Good. So I'm wondering given our knowledge that there are like 
a dozen advent back there. We might want to even stay back here for now. can see the next advent right there. So the question is, do we want to engage or <clears throat> do we want to stay here? One thing that I've learned with the reinforcement mechanics is you just don't want to con uh, you just don't want to stay at a certain position for too long. On the other end, we know that there are six uh, advents over here. How many turns do we have? We have a ranger. One assault. We theoretically would have enough turns to deal with one pack. Not sure if we can deal with two. Let's try something. I do have an idea. I'm not sure if it's a good one. But it is at least not stand, uh, sitting around and doing nothing. Alright, we know that there is a pack right there. Rapid deployment. And that's hitting three of them. Are you telling me they are not even coming? Oh. If only we could hit a little bit further. I mean, this here would hit one of them. This here probably triggers the entire pack. That was foreseeable, and as you can see, they were they were already triggered. So this here is taking their cover away. Bias scores a kill. No longer a threat. Think we might want to do another sniper shot. Let's kill this guy. 
Ok. Good, we're overwatching. And we're continuing to overwatch. Probably going to trigger the other pack now. Not good. Nice. Very nice. Upon reconsidering just what we did, I think we overall played it well. To make sure that we're that we were able to engage but like not over engaged. Okay, so that could be a kill. Good. Like to get Scooter more involved. And I'm fine pulling that other pack. The Purifier doesn't have any agency on us. Let's see if we can flank someone. Half cover is full cover for Baya. So this here is a full cover spot. Could area suppress three of them. Mitch moves into the next full cover. I mean, we got a couple of good shots over here. Set him up, knock him down. Already there. Running on gunning. Now it's time to be aggressive. I do have a plan, by the way. I'm not just charging in. Decent use of command. And that'll flush out the other soldier over there. Perfect. Fortunately, we're a bit too far away to flank.
probably going to suppress this guy in case we're not hitting it. Rascal moves up and has a chance to hit the guy in half cover. 50-50, come on. Moving up, we don't unfortunately need the elite prior fire. Pretty sure that there is no pack over here. Hunkering down. Overwatching with Bob and let's just sing and suppress him. Steady our weapon for next turn. Yeah, we're immune. Taking fire over here. Taking heavy fire. Enemies moving in our position. Good, we're getting we're getting some more visitors here. Let's end this farce. Yep, right. We're green to go. Taking a very small peek might pull another pack. That's why I wanted to stay in full cover. Okay. I think we're taking the ninety eight percent shot. Elite suppressor is good, very good. Good, time for Oscar Mike this turn. Guess we gotta move. We can flank over here. Well, it's not flanking. It's basically taking a second flank. But I rather would only like to have one soldier exposed. That way we can take high ground next turn. And we can essentially give him a protocol to make it unlikely that he's going to get hit in full cover. I know I'm just doing the exact opposite of what I've said earlier by exposing another soldier, but 
I want the high ground and we couldn't have reached it otherwise. We're still in full cover though. getting reinforcements again so just making sure that this viper here is doing nothing reloading would probably be a wise decision <laughs> But then again, steadying the weapon and killing someone, we can still reload next turn. Alright, Overwatch. Getting the civilians in cover. Another overwatch. And another overwatch. That's three. Good. All of her shots are missing. Are you shit? What? Wait, 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 wait. How did that work? So he ha she has squad side? Did I just witness that she was shooting like across the entire battlefield quite literally not giving a fuck about being suppressed wow okay Honestly speaking, I'm a little bit puzzled. Where's the last guy? Pretty sure there had been a mech. was in the mech, but I was still right. Reloading. Good, let's clean these guys up. Very good.
Okay. I'm still highly confused how the hell this Viper had a line of sight. Probably squad sight. But that was something else. All right, Rascal puts himself into full cover, high ground. Scooter moves up to do exactly the same. Okay, we can still suppress uh, the Viper. Whatever you say. Making sure that we're topped off, Aftermath took a pretty nasty shot. Fifty fifty is good enough. Maybe a flesh wound. And we're going for another suppression. that thing hitting into full cover whilst being suppressed. What? No problem, boss. That's a sniper snake. Bob Ross moves up. Wolverine moves up. Baya reloads. Aftermath. That's the longest grapple in the world. And decides afterwards to go into full cover so we can take high ground over there. Unfortunately, one of the VIPs died. I'm trusting you here. The rest of the mission really went well so far. Ready to engage. Reloading. Affirmative. Moving out. Rolling. 
by position stone here. And we have a couple of overwatches. Okay, well, it was already the next turn. My bad. We now wasted one turn for Overwatch. Seems doable. It almost seemed as if there was no alien movement, which lets me to believe we can simply move up. Okay. Overwatch, come get some. Affirmative. Covering now. More of them coming in. Okay, so we're I'm positioning sorry. sort of at the edges for everyone. I moves over here. Solid copy. Wolverine can take the full move and still overwatch. Maybe over. over here. On overwatch. Back online. That's a reload. And an overwatch. An overwatch, another overwatch, and another overwatch. Reload, overwatch. Affirmative, covering now. Scanning. You're telling me that those guys haven't triggered us. Okay. They just landed and no one took a shot. Good. Let's trigger them. A surprise! Who would have thought that there are reinforcements? Alright, that's one down. Pretty, but effective. Understood. Moving out. Ready to rock. Reloading. And just in case he does not die with a single shot. I can handle 
Good. Reinforcements are taken care of. Putting everyone a bit closer to the extraction zone so that we could theoretically just get out of here. <clears throat> Good time. On my way. <clears throat> to move everyone up. We're green to go. Reloaded. Whatever you say. Good, there is no Reinforcements come. Uh, there are no reinforcements coming in. There are still no reinforcements coming in. Come get them. And compared to the reinforcements that we had when we were needing to defend our city. This here is <coughs> extremely moderate. That won't do it. It's dead. It has to be dead. Hustle got me flanked. This is Firebrand. It's time to go. Not sure how they always manage to get into their cover without taking overwatch shots, but who cares. Probably can't kill them anyways. Although, you know what? Solid grenade might be... Might be enough to kill them. There you go. Done. Getting out of here. On my way. I'm on the move. Location confirmed. Not a problem. Good, and we're heading out. Just in time. Getting out of here. Let's go. Ah, fifty fifty. Not good. Getting out of here. Getting out of here. Good, we took one injury. Due to that sniper snake. Oh yeah, and we lost soldier. Yeah, it was the sniper snake, both of the cases.
All right, here we are. The guys are looking tired, most of them have lost quite a bit of will. And effectively no one was promoted, but we got a 15 days wound for Aftermath. That sucks. PCS Hyper Reactive Pupil is good. Suppressor, Elite Suppressor is good. With uh, soldiers starting to get injured again, we should improve the healing rate, which hopefully brings him down to seven days. Yeah, nine days, but that's good enough. And everyone else pretty much tired. But we defended two invade, uh, so an invasion and essentially a recruitment stop. Which means we can continue uh, just expanding. Setting course for East Africa. And look at that, we got a new recruit here in Brazil. Just after we almost stopped recruiting. Might as well put another Haven Advisor in here. As long as we're recruiting, that is. Afterwards, we can take the Haven Advisor out, and we do have another Commander, training ready. Supplies coming in. We'll need to seek out new means of replenishing our resources. I will be going more and more for incoming. I started appreciating the uh, skill to effectively reduce rocket damage by five, uh, by four. And that's us doing a nice little hacking of the workstation for Intel. That's going to happen the next time. For now, let's take a look at the situation. Well, this here looks incredibly barren and empty. Could go for more resistance communication. Uh, not necessarily sure if that is needed. I mean, we got the Intel to back it up and start getting uh, more regions, but I would want to keep it moderate. Uh, we need to also liberate all of them over time, so like one thing after the other. Um, in terms of supplies, it's so and so. Still missing the supplies to basically upgrade the ring here, which until the end of the month, we should definitely do. We are going to reduce the ad, uh, Avatar project, which is great. And we would then also start getting um, probably another investigation mission against one of the chosen. A, to get more resistance orders. They are pretty good and B, to be able to maybe infiltrate one of the bases. I'm probably choosing one of the two that we have already a little bit more information about, and then we're just preparing to raid his or her base. Would be nice to get rid of the assassin first, mainly because she's just so incredibly annoying. Yeah, 
As for the roster, most of our great teams are currently infiltrating, so really nothing that we can do to speed that up at the moment. And we gotta manage we gotta manage the rest with what we've got. We're soon going to have more rookies training here and here. Um, would give us two more rookies. And I think we're fine on the expansion of the roster. So yeah, overall everything looks good. We might want to have another scientist because one is currently injured. I mean, one of uh, them was the target of the Chosen's manipulation. So having another one would definitely be good just to keep the speed on all of the research. What I could do before we end this mission is I could essentially... Ah, I can't do that. Anyways, we're going to take uh, one of the uh, one of the specialists out of the um, resistance havens and just put it in here. I think that getting coil guns faster is actually better than generating intel. That is it for today. A little bit under an hour. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the content, leave a like and a comment uh, down below. Much appreciated and see you in the next mission. Bye bye.